All right, guys, here we go with attempt number four at Smart Talks versus The Streak. And we'll have Daniel Bryan, the leader of the Yes movement, going up against the dead man, The Undertaker. So in the last match there, we've seen Brock Lesnar unable to defeat The Undertaker in a match that we will see next week at WrestleMania 30. So Lesnar wasn't able to defeat Taker in the game, but will he be able to at WrestleMania 30? We'll have to wait and see for that one. Meanwhile, we'll have Daniel Bryan, who's going up against the game Triple H. And if he wins that match at WrestleMania 30, he'll be going on to join the world, the WWE World Heavyweight Championship match alongside Randy Orton and Batista. So I think Daniel Bryan's got a really good chance. I can see him beating Triple H. I think that's a definite. And then if he goes into the match, I think he does have a really good chance to win the title. I think that is the happy ending that everyone seems to be wanting. Because the other two, Randy Orton or Batista, either end, either ending really with them two win the title, I think it's going to be really flat. And that's something that you really don't want come WrestleMania. So Brian looks to be on fire in this match against The Undertaker. He's doing pretty well. So hopefully the same thing happens at the main WrestleMania 30 pay-per-view. Meanwhile, Undertaker taking on Brock Lesnar, as I mentioned before there. So this match here, I think this is actually something that prior to WrestleMania's announcements for Lesnar and Taker and Brian Triple H, I was actually quite wanting to see Daniel Bryan go up against them and take. I think this would be a really good match. And it's something I think I would probably prefer to the likes of Lesnar going against Taker. So maybe it could be something that we see next year. I thought Daniel Bryan's like the really big underdog and that's like his main thing. So if he was to go up against the streak and see he was actually able to defeat the streak, then obviously that then proves that he may not be the underdog after all if he can defeat the Undertaker and do what nobody else could. But at the same time, I really don't see Undertaker ever losing the streak. It's just got to a point now where anyone that sort of goes up against it, you know they're not going to win it. And trying to actually find someone to defeat Undertaker at WrestleMania, I think that's too much to ask now because if you go with a young star then it's a lot to put on the shoulders and you don't have that guarantee that they're going to be able to carry it and go at that next level. Meanwhile, Daniel Bryan here has got a signature and he's kicking away at the chest of the Undertaker. So Bryan really with up a hand here. Let's see if we can go for a finisher. Run a knee. Oh, we got it. There we go. Go for the first cover. One, two, ooh, that was actually a lot closer than I thought it would be. Go for another pin there, just quickly throw that in there, take a kicks out. So this attempt is probably the best attempt that I've actually had. Can Daniel Bryan defeat The Undertaker and show that he's not the underdog after all? Meanwhile, take him with that comeback. This could be bad. We'll reverse that. Try and stop him getting it in there. So give him some elbows. Try and wear him down a bit. Actually go for his tactic and maybe throw in some submissions. See if we can wear him down with those. I don't know how he can counter this. I don't know how he's gonna get out of this here. This is not the position you want. So a big abdominal stretch there. Wear and take her down. Not gonna tap out. But at least it gets some damage in there. We've got him in orange. Meanwhile, picks her up by the throat. Is he going to go for a comeback? I'm not going to give him the chance. Oh, but he's reversed it. So Daniel Bryan really going for it. But he didn't get out of that. Take on the slam there. Brian float over and the neck breaker. Impressive counter. Take her coming back. Gain a reversal. Dan Brian working on the arm. And we've got another signature in there, so let's try this out, see what we can do. Some more kicks to the chest. It's going well for the yes movement. Could Daniel Bryan be the one to defeat the streak? So let's try that submission. 
Go for the yes lock, and we've got it on there. Oh, but there's no chance he's going to tap out of this. We should have really worked him down a bit, or maybe gone for that run knee. And he's already out there. I think we lasted longer than the... Oh, the lights have gone out. Here comes Taker. We'll try and run away from him. He's got that finisher in there. Oh, misses with the... Oh. I thought he was going to go for a finisher there, but he seems to be keeping it. Or is he going to go for it now? No, we don't give him the chance. Daniel Bryan relentless here. Now working on the leg of the Undertaker. Not today, too fast. Taker reverses it. Looks like he's going to send him over the ropes. And he's going for that OMG moment. The Undertaker specific one. So let's see if we can reverse this. As he goes for the suicide dive. Oh, we didn't get that in there. Take with a big dive over the top rope. Only the Undertaker can do that. And he's signaling for the end there with the throat slash. Daniel Bryan, meanwhile, is completely out. Get some taunts worn in there. A couple of yes chants. And lock up with Taker. He gets up a hand. Reversal in there. Float up again into the neck breaker. Back in the ring. Daniel Bryan being cheered on. Oh, but take us in behind him. I thought he was going to get with there. And Daniel Bryan actually picking up the Undertaker. I didn't think that he would be able to. I thought that. Oh no, he's got it in the Hell's Gate. We may have to use resiliency, but it looks like we're okay at the moment. Hopefully that's something that comes in at WWE 2K15. The nice possum finishes there, because you really get them when you don't expect it. And it's something that really adds to the gameplay. Meanwhile, a third set of kicks here at the chest. Daniel Bryan is really going for this. So let's get over that corner. Signal the end. Bryan's saying no, but I'm saying yes. We hit the flying knee. Bryan's got the comeback, but he may not need it. Cover one, two. Three, Daniel Bryan has done it. Daniel Bryan has defeated The Undertaker at WrestleMania. Daniel Bryan has defeated the streak. So there we go. At attempt number four, Legend Killer Trophy. Smack Talks versus The Streak. Daniel Bryan versus The Streak. Daniel Bryan has done it. Daniel Bryan has defeated The Streak. Bryan defeats The Undertaker at WrestleMania 30. Maybe next year the Undertaker's name, Daniel Bryan, he could be the one. Bryan is the one to watch out for. WrestleMania 31, Undertaker Daniel Bryan, could we see what just happened? I cannot believe it. Guys, let me know what you think in the comments. Daniel Bryan, it's all about the yes movement. There ain't no stopping Daniel Bryan.